Hi, folks. My name is Melford Bibbins. Today, I'm pleased to be joined by Dr. Mark DeBrinkett, and we're going to talk precisely about how the GlycoCheck can both impact your patient results and what's going on in your clinic for cash flow and getting everybody to have a higher health score. And we're going to tell you what that higher health score means, but I wanted to get you primed for knowing that there is going to be a way to actually watch your patients increase their health. That's the most important aspect. And we all know it's, it's seeing is believing and patients actually want to see this. So Dr. Mark, thanks so much for being on today. I really appreciate it. Oh, great to be here, Mel. Thanks. I've been lucky enough to see a few of the COVID research studies that you've brought to the past, but I, I'm sure that some of the folks on here haven't gotten to see those yet. How has COVID impacted vascular health? And what has the glycocalyx been really shown to, how has the glycocalyx been shown to impact how COVID is actually doing damage to our bodies? Well, like I said, COVID has been um, engineered to destroy the glycocalyx. Mm. Okay. So that's the easiest way to say it. And so what we have seen is very disturbing. We have, um, I believe, about 12 published studies on COVID in the hospital with glycocalyx scores. And so one in particular, they had three groups of people that they divided into. People that came in with a diagnosis of COVID that got scanned with the glyco check. Mm -hmm. If they had a healthy score above seven, they would be in the hospital for less than a week and released with still a healthy score. Wow. Okay. The ones that came in with a three or below, we had two groups, one that was ventilated and one that was not ventilated. And we followed them for up to 45 days. And every few days, their scores dropped systemically. Okay. And it didn't matter if they were ventilated or not ventilated. Obviously, the ventilated was a little bit more dangerous and they were below the ones that weren't. But when you watch them every few days, they're both dropping in the same increments until they passed. Okay. And so not having a good score, getting COVID, most likely you're not going to make it. Okay. That's just the reality of it. So it really is important that you get checked to know what your risk factors are mm -hmm. because we have the tool to turn it around in as quick as three months you can regrow that lining and improve your score by more than a couple points. Yeah. And so know what your risk factors are mm -hmm. and then take the appropriate action so you don't put yourself into a situation where you're compromised and the infection gets the better of you. Gotcha. Yeah, it, I, I, I know a lot of folks hear on the news about long COVID and trying to differentiate between what COVID is and long COVID. Are, are we seeing the same impact on folks that have been suffering with this, who've, who've you know, been enduring long COVID for, you know, could be years on end? Are they yeah. seeing more of an impact on their glycocalyx than somebody that just has, you know, quote unquote, normal COVID? Well, again, we've studied multiple on this and there is a published study on long haul COVID. Mm -hmm. And what they have determined that if you've had COVID and it took you out, like let's say severely out, like you knew that you were down and out. A lot of people had it and they were just kind of like mild symptoms and then they kind of got over it. I'm not talking about those people. I'm talking about the people that they hit bottom and it found all their old injuries in their body and it mm -hmm. ran havoc on them and they had to go relive all of that. Mm -hmm. Okay. Those people had so much damage because of COVID into their vascular system that they've studied those people for two years and they're still not better, okay? They still haven't been able to naturally restore their microvascular health without Endocalyx Pro. Hmm. And then the other ones that were on Endocalyx Pro, we've proven that it takes around four months to get past long haul COVID if you take a double dose of this supplement. Otherwise, you're looking at two years and still no change. Oh. So we know a lot of people that have been sick and they just haven't been there themselves. Maybe they gained some weight and they never gained weight before. Mm -hmm. Maybe they can't get rid of the weight, but they always used to get rid of weight easy. Mm -hmm. Maybe they're not sleeping well. Maybe their old conditions flared up. Okay. It has the ability to attack your weakest parts of your nervous system and your body. And depending on what your past was and how many traumas you've had, mm -hmm. it's going to affect everybody a little bit differently. But it also depends on your immunity. You know, if you're running yourself wild and run your immunity down and you let it in, it can run havoc. And once it gets a hold of you, as many of us know, it's not a pleasant thing. Mm 
Well, Dr. Mark DeBrenke, thank you so much for being on today. I really appreciate it. For anybody watching, go to microvascularuniversity.com. You can watch this interview. You can see case studies. You can see so much more about how the glycocheck is going to impact the health and longevity of your patients. Thanks so much for watching. Have a great day.